This is incredible. It's like a, it's like an amusement park ride. <laughs> this one's doing it too. Look at that. It's such a drama queen. It's me. If I were a spotlight. I don't want you to be that long. Oh look, I broke the game again. This is fun. I kind of meant tempted just to leave this threatening wire that will electrocute anybody that attempts to break in. Ahoy there! My name is Wifey Well, but you may call me Wifey, and today we're back playing some more of Fallout 4. Last episode, I built this kind of like welcome sign and platform, which I have additional plans for. I think I would like to add, you know, some security, maybe move some spotlights up here, maybe even move the whole sign forward itself. I don't know, we'll get all that in a minute because I first need to give a huge thanks and an update. Um, so I know last episode I kind of mentioned my great grandmother, which I don't like to mention first off like sad things or things about my personal life really like that. Um, but me and the family, we were kind of convinced this was it. And I knew if it was it that I would be gone for a while. But I am very excited to report that though she went to the ER Tuesday um, and, you know, was unresponsive, wasn't doing very well. It is now Friday evening. I just got home from seeing her. She is doing much better. She's alert. She's on antibiotics. She's um, not on much oxygen. She ended up having um, a form of pneumonia where you take something foreign into your lungs and get an infection and get really ill. Um, she's she's doing great. Um, I, I, I can't believe it. She is such a strong little cookie. Um, but I just wanted to say thank you guys for all of your thoughts, your prayers, your well wishes, sending me all the good vibes. It really meant the world to me. You guys are the best. I don't deserve you guys, and I just appreciate it more than I could ever explain. Um, so yeah, that is an update. I'm so happy to give a positive update. Um, but okay, back to this. Enough of the gushy stuff. Back to struggling. I have been a lot of effort into this because you know it's the first thing you see when you walk into the sanctuary and I know I got this situated and we kind of had it in the episode we're out of time but I was thinking like maybe I should move the guard towers more into these corners possibly um, pull the fence forward but maybe not and then I might have to move these connectors at this point now. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what we can do. And I also kind of want to get rid of these lamps. And just put in more spotlights. I just feel like it's... They almost look like they don't belong now here in the front. So... Hmm. I guess let's, let me close this. And then we'll get into build mode. And basically undo all of my hard work. I think I'm gonna... Well, I was gonna say at least move these. I wanted everything to stay powered. But I guess I won't. Everything is unpowered. Much quieter now. Hopefully this isn't when the raiders and super mutants are like, Oh yes, the sanctuary is no longer guarded. Let's move in, fellas. Um... The thing with moving this platform forward is it took so long to actually get it leveled. But I wonder if I pull this piece and just move it to this side. Hmm, we'll see. It would go in that center one, so then this one would go there. That might be okay. I think it's okay. 
I don't think it's too obstructive. But then, this piece, I would want to try and put... <laughs> just me casually breaking apart the entire sign. I would want this then to go... forward, and I don't think it's going to unless I pull off these. Show you guys what I mean. Well, I'm not really sure why it doesn't want to connect forward. Maybe I can get... Hold on. Let me set these out of the way. Luckily, they can just re-snap together. Yeah, isn't that interesting how it doesn't want to snap on this side? What I'll try then is I will... Oh, there we go. Oh, well that works. I was going to build it out and then have it turn and then do it, but that works. That works easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Honestly, I'm, I'm shocked at how well that worked just now. Usually, things don't work so well for me. At least not on the first try. Um, so, if I want to get these centered, I would need to use um, the double wide blocks. Which I added that as a little note while I was editing because I realized that as I was editing what this issue was here. So actually, I know I just placed these, but I might see if I can just do this, as it should be the same width. And then this should hopefully want to snap on and match that height. Yes, there we go. See, I'm learning. Lovely. So this got moved forward very easily, like no issues there whatsoever, right? Now the next thing I kind of want to do is um, move the guard towers more so into the corners. Which this, now that I'm looking at it, worries me a little. Because it looks like it might be a little too wide, what with the gate there. But I could always push back the gate. You know what? I should... Let me do a save. Let me do a save in case all this is just awful. So... Pick up the gate. And move the gate. Let's see if I can get these guard towers tucked into the corner like I was thinking. Ooh. It is floating though a little bit. Um... Ooh, that's nice. That's really nice. Ooh, that's really nice. This way the guards are more forward. There's not a bunch of stuff in their view. Their shooting line of sight. Yes, yes. It's, it's beautiful. Might move this one a little back, though. Oh, I like that. I do. Now comes the question of the gate, though. I will say, the gate makes me feel secure, but I'm already getting tired of having to open and close it every time I want to work on something. Interesting. If we put it, like, way back here... Hmm. 
The width of this is just a little wider than the width with the guard towers. And I think they can get through, okay? But also with it like that, it makes me worry that someone will just go poop and jump right on in. But if I bring it, like, way forward, it doesn't even want to... Well, it considers it there, which is interesting, actually. Because it wouldn't be... Terrible there. The only thing is, it's obviously flying. But... Um... I kind of don't mind it. I kind of don't mind it. I just think it would need sunk a little, but at the same time, I'm looking at the gate and if I were to sink it, then... I don't know if it would open, or at least if it did open, it would look it would look dumb, you know. But does this look dumb with this flying like this? I gotta try and remember where the actual like fences like that were, the junky pieces. Um, okay, I found it. It may have taken 84 years, but I found it. But yeah, I almost wonder if I should just do a doorway door doorway. I was looking if there's any more like this. Hmm. Thinking we might have to keep this. I just don't know. How I feel about it. If I could put in a wall here on the side, which kind of acted as like a barrier here, and then I wouldn't mind it. <clears throat> hmm. 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 Interesting. I think I'm gonna just leave it here, in the front, where it's beautiful. I'm gonna have to reclose it, it looks like, and then grab it. Come on. I saw it flick green, I'm trying to get it like as close to that platform that I built as possible. Come on, I saw you flicker green. Uh, it seems a little crooked. Work. Thank you. <laughs> Just yell work and then it'll work for you. That's the lesson here, folks. I want to put something under it to make this not so blatantly, obviously floating, but... Hmm. You guys probably have a good idea for that. Whereas me, everything I would try would probably make it fail. Unless I just, like, put some posts in through here. Kind of like those barn uh, warehouse-looking posts. But... Eh, I don't know. I'm not going to worry about it right now. Instead, what I'm going to worry about is just getting everything reset up, like the power and such. So, we're going to get... Hmm... Where are the spotlights at? Oh, they're here. Duh. 
So the connector is there. Okay, maybe instead we put the connector... Come on. The conduit. Maybe we put one here. And then grab another. And add it in on the end. On this end. Maybe. And then... Not the gate, I'm looking at the light. Hmm. Lasai. I never wanted to go on this side. It kind of is like, yeah, I will, but only in a certain spot. Hmm. May need to think more about this or even just do an underneath one here. Maybe that's what I should just do. One like this. In the corner, maybe? Is that connected? I think it is. I'll put one there and then I'll move it. Really? I would have thought that would have been fine. There. Do it that way. I had to get a wire down first to do that wire glitch. Did I grab the light? The conduit? Okay. So I had to grab one of these. Just kind of put it here. Connect it. And then... Hear that. Bam. I don't even know why it didn't want to do it to begin with. I mean, th that seems like a feasible wire. It doesn't... It's not going through anything, so like, what the heck. And then I need to leave the... One... I wonder if this will stretch, actually, from here. Oh, good. Thank goodness. Just do that that way. Cool. Ooh. Are my spotlights working? Mmm. I'm gonna get this now to connect to this. So boop magical. And why is it not recognizing any of these lines now? Why am I not? There we go. Okay, we should be good now. Yes, yeah, spotlights are up and working, though these are kind of silly there, aren't they? And let me just reconnect, um, well, reset up these in the corner. No, do not attack my spotlight. Oh my gosh. Let me just get this reset up in the corner, because those on the, on the guard towers looks kind of silly, don't you think? Just slightly silly, just slightly ridiculous. Grab it. Put it. Eh. No, not like that. Grab it. Grab it like this. Okay. It is very hard to line that up. I don't want it hanging off. I want it in the corner. I might just call that fine. And then same with this one here in the corner. 
Sure. I don't want you. I don't want you. I want this one. And this one. Okay. And then furthermore, I actually might move these up here if they'll let me. Whoa. Whoa, look at this. This is incredible. It's like a it's like an amusement park ride. Okay, we'll spin back this way, Mr. Light. And go I want you like right here. And you're not really I guess that's fine, right there. And then <laughs> this one's doing it too. Look at that. It's such a drama queen. It's me. If I were a spotlight. I, I, I don't want you to be that long. Oh look, I broke the game again. This is fun. I kind of meant him to just to leave this threatening wire that will electrocute anybody that attempts to break in. And then these are... Now it has a note... Oh, it rewired itself. Let me just... Ugh, let me get rid of this wire. My goodness. Or maybe I should even put it way up here. It'd probably be more effective the higher it was, right? Yeah, why don't I just do that? So I guess let me get rid of this fun wire as well. And then get you... Eh, go up. No, not that up. Go oh my gosh. <laughs> it's so dramatic. Okay. Yes. No. Yes. Okay. Okay. We did it. My goodness. No. Not like that. Okay. Um. No. No. This is not the angle for this. Maybe I can get it from this one. No, let me try it from from inside. Darn it, gotta open this gate again. Um Now that I have so many wires running around, this is a little harder. Oh my gosh, it's hard. There we go. And then a wire glitch. This one, hopefully. I won't need it to recognize that I'm trying to do electricity. Okay, that worked there. Come on. So hard to... There we go. To select those spotlights on this signboard. And I'm not really sure why, but wow, look at this. These lights are really shining up the place now. Okay. Very happy with that. Now we need to get some like high-tech security going. And oh, I also need to string this to something get my little vault girls their jobs back excellent ok 
Okay. And then we'll get some more defenses put in. Um, we did the Enclave because they were pretty intimidating looking. Okay. Um, how am I gonna put this up here? I should probably get a ladder. But... Uh, I have this one a little more forward, and it's probably better a little more forward. Let me... Actually, let me put it, like, on the edge. Oh, hello, Marcy! How are you doing? <laughs> She's like, I left and I came back, and you're still working on this entrance. Yes, I am, my dear. I want it to be perfect. It's a sanctuary, you know? It has to be. Oh, he's here too! Hi! That one's a little more to the right than this one, I think. Just slightly. Okay, great. And now we just gotta hook these up too. Which... Nice. And... Ooh, yay! Look at this. This is, a, this is a big improvement, isn't it? I couldn't tell you why happiness is down because this is amazing. If happiness is down, then it's just because, um, people don't appreciate good things. People don't appreciate nice things. Right, Preston? Preston, you just did the shortest security shift I've ever seen in my life. That was like three seconds of security. Oh well. It doesn't matter. We don't need him now that we have all this going. Um... I could still, of course, put in some more guns here, but I think this is a pretty good start. I'm much happier with this setup than I was with it previously, so long as we just leave the gates open. The floating gate isn't super noticeable, so long as it is a is is wide open, I mean. I am considering my options, even if it's like I sink a decor block or something. I saw something earlier when I was looking around. Like, see, just something like, well, not a cave, but if I just put a crate here or something, something to sink under it and make it look like it's floating, that isn't like a huge platform. Or make it look like it's not floating, I meant. Sorry, I'm kind of, I'm kind of just doing... I'm blabbing too much. And when I start blabbing too much, all the words start running together and it becomes a nightmare. So I think I'm just going to hush and go for now. But I, I, I think I think this is good. Let me know what you think. I, I'm curious if you guys liked it how it was before or if you think this is a good improvement. That's going to be it. So as always, I hope that you enjoyed. I appreciate you being a well watcher and I will see you again very soon. Bye!